today's video is regarding HP and Y Pro 6400 series printer I'm going to show you how to do the wireless setup Wi-Fi direct setup so we are going to use the printers inbuilt Wi-Fi and uh, if you don't have a home or office Wi-Fi network then you can use this for the wireless printing and scanning first is to switch on the printer we need to print the printer information page so that we can find out the password of this printer on the control panel just press the information button once and it will send a command for the printer to print a page and in this page look for the Wi-Fi direct icon and below that you will see the name of the printer that is actually the Wi-Fi name and the password of this printer so it's here iPhone or Android phone or a smartphone or any other device you have and download the HP smart app from the App Store once you download that go to the setting and open the Wi-Fi network so in the Wi-Fi network look for the printer's name here so it should be the same name direct BD HP and Y Pro 6400 click on that enter the password as it was displayed on the page click on the join button so here we can see it has it is connected but it says no internet connection because this printer has no internet it's we are just using printer for the printing open the HP smart app we need to add the printer so that we can do the wireless printing and scanning for that click on the printer button which is add printer or you can also click on the plus button on the top on the next screen we see the name of the printer is displayed here HP and Y Pro 6400 series click on that now I'll show you how to do the scanning for example so click on the scan button now look for the printer scan option and click on that so once you see this screen now we can load the A4 size sheets here for the scanning or we can also place the page for scanning on the scanner bed so first I'm going to place it here so it goes like this facing upwards So once we install we click on this button so this printer is really good if you are looking for multiple scannings at a time you can place all the documents together here and then it will scan all the pages and it will transfer it as a one file here so here we can see it has transferred the file here now if you want you can do the share or save so click on that button and you can change the name you can also change the format to PDF and also the file size and then click on the share or save button then you will see more options here where you can send it as a whatsapp or you can send it as an email and you can also save it if you want here any and you can also save it in a particular location or if you want you can slide up and you will see copy or save to HP smart app save to the files so there are a number of options you can do for example I'm going to save it to the HP smart app which is more convenient whenever I have to find the scan I have to go back and look there so now if you want to find out where this page has gone just click on the view and print section here and on the top you see HP smart files and just on the first file the recent file should be the this one so that is here so this way we can use this printer when you don't have any home or office internet or Wi-Fi network then you can just simply use the printers inbuilt Wi-Fi system which is really good and efficient thanks for watching